Hey everyone, it's Kenan, your trusted tech nerd for all things value packed. Now, I don't know if you have any plans in the near future to make a DIY desktop computer, but if you're going to do that, you must know that a suitable power supply is very important. And I don't know when it started, but it seems like high power power supplies right now are all the rage. I don't know if it's because CPUs and graphics cards are just so expensive that no one cares about how much money they dish out for power supplies, am I right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. But clearly, using a high power power supply does have its benefits. Number one, it can make your expensive CPU and graphics card last much longer. Number two, it can decrease the amount of electricity you use, making you more energy efficient. And three, the other functions can bring you more convenience and stability while using it. I have here the Segotep Xingu GP Series 750 Watt Gold Power Supply. Xingu is a desktop power supply company that has been around for a long time, longer than me, and I'm pretty old. They were founded in 1986 and have a worldwide reputation for power supplies, chassis, and radiators. Now, I said before that a good power supply can make your CPU and your graphics card last much longer. This is marked with 750 watts. But how much power do we really need? I ran some tests. Okay, when browsing the web and replying to emails, a computer needs only about 60 to 100 watts. I have here that if you are going to play games or make videos, you need about 120 to 350 watts. Now we might get a little technical here, but when a power supply is at 50% load, okay, 50% load, that means that we are at peak efficiency. That means that internal temperature and stability are at peak performance. So if you're using a full set of high-end capabilities, you know, you're playing high-res games, you're editing films, you're live streaming or whatever, choosing a 750 watt power supply is not only appropriate, but it's essential for the long-term health of your computer. Remember, a 750 watt power supply means that it can provide up to 750 watts of power, but it doesn't mean that the power consumption will remain at 750 watts. The actual power consumption depends on the motherboard, the CPU, the graphics card, etc., how they're all being used, and the power supply will only provide the amount of required power. Two, remember I said that we can decrease the electricity expense. As I said before, when a power supply is at 50% load, we are at peak efficiency. What this means is that our power conversion rate is at its strongest, at its highest. So what does that mean? That means to output a certain X amount of power. The amount of power input required is the least. If you're still on the fence for some reason, I'll have you know that this power supply has passed the 80 plus gold certification. I haven't heard of that certification. Let me explain. 80 plus is recognized as one of the most stringent power saving codes in the world, which is directly related to your monthly electricity bill. At the beginning, it was divided into four levels, 80 plus, 80 plus bronze, 80 plus silver, 80 plus gold. Later, two higher levels were added, namely 80 plus platinum and 80 plus titanium. The 80 plus gold standard used by this device refers to the power conversion rate of 87% at 20% load. If it's a 50% load, the conversion efficiency at this time is the highest, which can reach 90%. And if it's 100% full-time, full load operation, the conversion rate can still maintain more than 87%. This means that your entire setup is more energy efficient and environmentally friendly. Then you may be wondering, what are the conversion rates of the other levels? You know, is, is gold actually good or should I need, do I need something better? Let me answer you. The most basic 80 plus standard, no matter the workload, the conversion rate can reach 80%, okay? The most basic 80%. Remember, 80 plus gold is 87 to 90% depending on the load. Now, titanium standard has between 90 and 94% conversion depending on load. Please refer to the picture for detailed comparison. As you can see, the gold metal is in the middle position. Maybe you've seen this when shopping for power supplies before. Products with reasonable prices and guaranteed quality are all basically 80 plus gold certified. You know, I don't want you to waste your money, okay? Spending tons of extra dollars for titanium standard 
just to get maybe up to 4% higher conversion, I don't think it's such great bang for your buck. I think we should just stick with the 80 plus gold. For high power power supplies, manufacturers typically add many small functions to make them more useful. There are so many here that I'm gonna use my list to help us out. You've got OVP, that's over voltage protection. OCP, over current protection. OPP, over power protection. OLP, over load protection. UVP, under voltage protection. OTP, over temperature protection. SCP, short circuit protection. These features can automatically shut down your computer if the current or the temperature gets too high. Your computer will not fall to the hands of tiny mechanical failures. This power supply is also an APFC power supply. That is an active power factor correction power supply. What does that mean? This power supply not only saves power, but it also has wider voltage adaptability. So it works very stably under wide voltage fluctuations. All right. Let's look inside the box. Now, here we have a full module power supply, which means, whoa, nice, that we can select the cables we need individually. That makes it easier to organize within the chassis. What do I see here? Ah, the fan, the 140 millimeter super quiet fan. You will enjoy serene silence with this baby. But back to the cables. Ah, look at all these options. We have the 24 pin connector for the motherboard. We've got the connector for the SATA drive, the CD drive, and provided all these cables. Okay, check this out. We've got our motherboard cables, our SATA cables, our drive cables, whatever you need to connect inside your computer, it's all right here. Oh, here's an ancient fossil in the IT world. The famed 3.5 floppy disk. Yes, I know what this is, which means I need to go to a retirement home. You don't need to know what this is, probably, <laughs> okay? Finally, I have to mention that compared to the power supplies of four or five or even many more years ago, they have added a very convenient switch on the external part, okay? So now we can manually cut off power or turn power on without having to unplug a cord. Really convenient. All right, let's review. It has 80 plus gold certification. It is environmentally friendly. It saves power. It has plus APFC active PFC design. It's got OVP, UVP, OPP, SCP, OCP, OTP, multiple protection measures. It comes with a five-year warranty. These features can let you use it with confidence. It's also got full modular design, an additional switch button, and a 140 millimeter ultra quiet fan. You can hardly hear any movement while this is working in standby. That's pretty awesome. This is a very valuable high-end product. 750 watts of power can be applied to almost all configurations. So whether you're browsing the web, working or playing games, making movies, you will not be disappointed. The standard for what makes a good power supply hasn't changed for many years. Invest well once and be pleased for years to come. In fact, I bet you can pass this on to your grandkids. Just kidding, you probably don't wanna do that. But anyway, that's it for today. I really hope this product brings you a lot of value. Thank you and see you next time. What's up eggheads, Kenan here with Newegg now, always bringing you the best products for the sweetest, sweetest prices. If you're looking for a way to upgrade your Wi-Fi experience, if you're tired of dealing with ethernet cables and if you're on Windows 10 64 bit, look no further. I've got the one, the only Fenvi FV-AX3000R Wi-Fi 6 PCIe wireless adapter here. I value your time, so let's just get right to it and open the box. Okay, here we are, everything you get in the box. An instruction manual, a cute little CD with drivers. That's really nice. A low profile bracket for small form factor builds. Included in the little baggie is a Bluetooth cable. You get two high gain antennas. Check it out, we got the two high gain antennas right here. And of course, the FV-AX3000R Wi-Fi 6 wireless adapter. By default, the AX3000R is attached to the standard profile bracket, as you can see. But again, just to remind you, they do include the small form factor bracket if you need it, all right? Also notice the large, handsome heatsink that's already on the chip, ready to operate at full performance without overheating or throttling. Thank you, Fenvi. 
that's a very good thing. It'll distribute heat away from the core components and stay cool even if you're doing those large intensive file transfers over your network or if you're gaming or streaming high-res movie files or whatever. The chipset underneath the heatsink is the Intel AX200 chipset which allows this Wi-Fi adapter to operate on 5 gigahertz and 2.4 gigahertz dual band, all right? And that gives you wireless speeds up to 2400 megabits per second at the 5 gigahertz band and 574 megabits per second at the 2.4 gigahertz band. Of course, your router still needs to support Wi-Fi 6, okay? Check your router, please. I don't wanna be blamed for a bad router. All right, as I alluded to before with that included Bluetooth cable, the AX3000R also supports Bluetooth 5.0, easily pairs with Bluetooth keyboards, mice, and other peripherals. If that wasn't enough, you also get two by two MUMIMO, M-U-M-I-M-O, that's multiple user, multiple input, and multiple output. It also supports OFDMA. That's obviously orthogonal frequency division multiple access. This is perhaps the most important feature of Wi-Fi 6. It basically allows for multiple users with various bandwidths to be served simultaneously. In the traditional approach, unique users compete to upload data, but in Wi-Fi 6, 802.11ax schedules the users to avoid clashes. That's just awesome. Also included, of course, are the two high gain antennas ensuring greater Wi-Fi coverage, enhanced stability, further ensuring a smooth internet experience. I speed tested this with the antennas installed and this was actually the second FEMV adapter with which I achieved a speed slightly greater than with an ethernet cord plugged directly into my NIC. That's just crazy. And lastly, talking about compatibility, I sort of hinted at it before, this will only work with Windows 10 64-bit, okay? I'm sorry if you're on another operating system, it just won't work. But if you are on Windows 10 64-bit, whether you're on a mid-tower, full-tower, or mini-tower computer with the low profile and full height bracket provided, this will fit your PCIe slots. It'll fit PCIe slots from X1 to X16 lanes, suitable for almost all PCs. And with that, you'll get that 2.4 gigahertz and five gigahertz dual band frequency, less lag, greater coverage with the high gain antennas, the Wi-Fi 6 features of MUMIMO and that orthogonal frequency division multiple access, the Bluetooth 5.0. I mean, it's just a great, Wi-Fi upgrade for your desktop. Instant 802.11ax, what more can I say? My dear eggheads, the Fenvi FV-AX3000R Wi-Fi 6 PCIe wireless adapter. For specific prices, please check the description or click that link below. Let me know down in the reviews or comments just how much your Wi-Fi experience improves with this adapter. I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, and now you know. Hey guys, been getting that urge to play computer games for hours and hours? With all the great new games that have been released recently, I know I have. Luckily for all you gamers today, I'm going to present something we could all use to enhance our gaming experience. Ta-da! Meet the Autofull Gaming Chair. Pretty eye-catching, huh? It certainly stands out from the competition, that's for sure. And once you hear about all the cool features it offers, I'm sure you'll agree that it's a unique deal among gaming chairs. Just look at the pink bunny ears. It comes equipped with a headrest and a lumbar cushion to support your neck and waist. Just what you need to keep you comfortable through those long gaming sessions. In addition, the rabbit ears and premium fox fur tail, beep beep. <laughs> will make you look cuter while you game. The gaming chair is made from carefully selected material, premium PU leather and high density shaping foam. This provides greater comfort, antioxidation, elasticity, resilience, and lifespan. It also comes with functions like 360 degree <laughs> swivel and the ability for the chair back to be locked at any angle between 90 to 150 degrees, which makes it suitable for gaming, working, even napping. <laughs> it also features 
SGS certified class four explosion proof gas lift that can support up to 300 pounds. This chair is also sideways rotatable and has seven level height adjustable ergonomic armrest. The armrest cover is soft to the touch and completely removable. It also has premium rolling casters, which ensure minimum noise and prevent scratches on the floor. Considering how expensive floors can be, having a gaming chair that does not cause scratches is pretty important. And also to protect the floor and add to the overall feel, you will get a complimentary pink mat as well. The ergonomic design of the gaming racing chair is another important feature. It's designed to support your head, spine, and lumbar with a removable headrest pillow and lumbar cushion. This three-point ergonomic system provides high performance support for your body, keeping your head, neck, and back comfortable even through long gaming sessions. Load capacity is another great feature of this gaming chair. Its cutting edge nylon base has a weight capacity of up to 300 pounds. In terms of seating area dimensions, it has a 22 inch by 20.8 inch width and depth and has a backrest dimension of 22.44 inch by 30 inches. Its seat height is adjustable up to 3.15 inches. It is pretty awesome. I know I would be jealous of anyone with such a fantastic and cute gaming chair. If you value the experience you have when computer gaming, then the Audifull gaming chair is a must buy. Hey guys, curious about what I've got in front of me? It is the Aoster Motor Folding Electric Bike, of course. It is the perfect electric bike for people who regularly cycle to work or who enjoy riding just for the leisure. Once you've finished listening about this folding electric bike, I am sure you'll want to get one for yourself. First, the bike has a powerful motor and good battery capacity. The folding electric bike has a 500 watt high speed brushless motor, giving you a strong driving force and great endurance. Its removable lithium battery supports up to 25 miles per hour. That is quite a great speed for an electric bike, don't you think? It has a range distance of 15.5 to 21.7 miles, depending on power mode and road condition, and has a charging time of only four to six hours. It provides you with three riding modes, pedal mode, boost mode, and power mode. In my opinion, I think many people will love the boost mode. So in the boost mode, the bike also gives you five levels to choose from, 20%, to 80% boost, and that's adjusted just here. Those are quite impressive figures, and the ability to choose from three different modes gives you choice instead of being stuck with just one mode. The bike is also quite impressive in terms of its quality and size. It uses a light and strong aluminum alloy collapsible frame. It takes up minimal storage space and can easily fit into any vehicle. Suitable for adults from about five foot three to six foot three, with an adjustable seat height of four inches. And when it's folded, it's only 27.56 inches by 35.42 inches. The bike is also quite considerate when it comes to safety and ease of assembly. It arrives 90% assembled, so you do not need to worry about spending a lot of time putting it together. As for safety, the bike uses a 20 by four inch flat tires, which you can see on both sides here, which can adapt to snow, sand, and other complex topography. And the front of the rear disc brakes fully ensure your safety. The bike is also special in that it is fully equipped. The mini electric bike comes with an LCD display it will display the battery power, speed, mileage, and power mode when you're riding. The front and rear fenders can prevent muddy water splashes. And if you ever forget to charge it, it is built with a Shimano 7 speed transmission using a rear derailleur to give you a comfortable riding experience in pedal mode.
All these great benefits brought by the Aoster Motor folding electric bike are truly impressive. I personally think that this electric bike can change your life for the better. It considers the many different challenges that people who use electric bikes can face and it overcomes all of them with the advantages it brings. If that is not enough, then perhaps you'll be won over by its appearance. Just from taking a long look at its simple design and sleek coloring, I already feel comforted. I am sure you will feel that comfort too when you have the folding electric bike at your fingertips. Do not deny yourself the joy of owning this incredible electric bike. Hi guys, I'm Tom here for New Egg Now. So if you're building a PC, you've got to have quality power supply cables, ideally at a similarly decent price. But don't worry, we've got you. This is the Asia Horse Extension Cable Kit. So let's have a look inside. Inside the box, we have black and white combs for all the cables and the cables themselves. We have one 24 pin ATX extension cable, one four plus four pin EPS cable and two six plus two pin PCIe cable. Now these guys are suitable for both single six pin or eight pin GPU. Let's talk about the quality though. So these guys have the latest nylon braid design, making them high quality. They're very flexible as well. And they're very easy for you to organize with vivid braided cables for that modular 16 AWG multicolor PSU cable extensions. But the real question is so, will these cables work for your particular setup? Well, they are UL 1015 18 AWG cables. So they're high spec like, and they can easily handle your ultra high power supply or whatever else you might try to throw at it, such as EVGA, Supernova series or Corsair RM series, etc. Do these guys do their job well? Yeah, they really do. So the new individually sleeved cables are actually heat shrink free. That means that they have this high quality cable assembly and support for high currents, which gives you, of course, superior performance and stability. They're really reliable, they're good quality, and I'd say they're a solid choice to add to your setup. If you want any more information, just check the link out below. I'm Tom from Newegg Now, and I'll see you next time.